DeAndre there took a lot of hits today. Is it frustrating at a certain point when that just kind of keeps happening, or how do you stay positive when it does? Um, just get up. Um, I had a season and injury last last year, so you know when I get hit now, I'm just thankful to get back up and just focus on the next play. Talk about their defense. Did you see anything from Syracuse's defense today that surprised you, or what were they doing out there? No, they were doing the same thing that they did on film all week. They kept it simple and they played harder than us. What do you think the issues are with the offense? Um, just we keep taking turns making mistakes at every position. Uh, we got to come in sync and we got to be one unit and we got to move together. Right now, we just make little mistakes. We just keep taking turns, either as receivers, quarterback, running back. Tight end, O line, we just keep taking turns and then keep killing our drives. It seemed like you got really frustrated at the end of the game after being hit over and over again. What were you telling your own to play? Just don't quit. Just keep fighting. Um, you know, continue to fight. You know, we can't quit. We we down, we're losing right now, but let's not quit. You know, let's continue to have keep our pride high. We continue to play this game that we love to play. What's the frustration level right now, guys? Um, we went down. We win some, we lose some, and it is what it is. Of course, we're, we're frustrated as an offense because we're not putting up the points that we want to put up, but frustration is not going to make us any better. Um, we can be frustrated for today, but when we wake up tomorrow, we got to forget about it and get back to the board. Were you seeing progress in practice this week? And what really felt like, and Coach Bell felt like last week, you guys were pretty close. What did practice look like this week, and how surprising you you guys didn't have much success? Yeah, I'm very surprised because uh, the coaches did a great job of preparing us. Um, they had the game plan ready. Um, we knew what, they, what they were going to do on defense. Coach Bell did a great job preparing me. Um, I felt like the game was moving slow for me, and I felt like I knew where to go with the ball. Um, but like I said, it was just we kept taking turns, and that kept killing our drives. And when you kill drives, you only get so many in the game versus the offense like Sarah. Jerry, Alex said you were very positive with the O line, regardless of how many hits you take. How important is that to you to be that way? Is it really? um, I just continue to try to stay positive. Negativity only brings more negativity. Um, and I know they're getting a lot of negativity from you know everybody else on the outside. So I just stay positive with those guys and let them know that I love them and just don't quit on me because I'm not going to quit on y'all. I know, only, I know it's only three games, but are you concerned about the level of fan support or them questioning you guys? No, nah, fans going to come and go. Either way, I got to worry about our locker room and um, my brothers and everybody that's in our Florida State family. The fans will come and they will go. It's like in the first half, the defense played really well and kept you guys in it. Do you talk to those guys at all about hanging with you guys? Yeah, I talked to the defense a lot, man. I told them thank you. And they did an outstanding performance. And each week, they continue to come out and play hard. And we have to play hard on the offensive ball. We're getting outplayed every, every game. We, We're just not playing hard enough. It's not the coaches, it's not the the play calling, it's not the scheme. We're prepared, we're just not playing hard enough. Every team is playing harder than us. People outside are gonna question Willie, because this is his first season, and these three games haven't been great. But how much confidence do you guys still have in Coach Tiger and the staff? I have the utmost confidence in Coach Tiger. Um, Like I said, each week, he's preparing us for whoever team we play. And he's doing a great job. He's making us understand skiing, making us understand what they're going to do and when they're going to do it. Um, it's just us as players to execute. We got to grow up as a team. We got to grow up and continue to fight and continue to stay focused. And it's just positive energy. That's all we need right now. Did Syracuse play worse or better than you expected going into today's game? They played better. They played, they played as expected. I knew they were going to come and play hard. I remember playing here two years ago. They played us hard then. And now that we're back, I knew they were going to come play hard at home. All right, thank you.